Yo, look here on a channel based in Jamaica, taking you on another journey to St. Thomas to a waterfall located in Bath. I'm your host, Glash. Check out our other pages on Instagram and TikTok. Now, let the adventure begin. Don't be shy, look here. Our journey is taking us to downtown Kingston at the Big Tree at the Morant Bay bus stop. Downtown Kingston isn't the safest place to be, so having your phone out like I did isn't the smartest thing to do. But I didn't want to just tell you where to take the bus, I actually wanted you to see where you should take the bus. In my opinion, the journey wasn't long. At most, it took an hour due to construction being on the route. Bus fare is $250. Once you reach to Morant Bay, this is where you would exit the bus. Ask for a taxi going bath, the fare is $200. The journey to bath took about another hour. But once you reach the botanical garden, this is your next stop. Once you arrive at the church, you can make your way up the hill. I know you must be thinking, why Glashwiki Turiso? But the journey up the hill is actually a lot easier than it seems. You can charter a taxi, which is another $200 to your journey. Okay, so to ensure that this video met the requirements I promised earlier, I cut a lot of the walking aspects of the video but kept the most important parts. Any key information that you need to know, I will let you know. On your right is the Bath Fountain Hotel and Spa, which is around six to eight thousand per night. The path is a straight one, so just continue on the trail and you will reach where you need to be. It was said that the water is 130 degrees, hot enough to ease those aching muscles, but not hot enough to leave lasting burns. Don't forget to ask about their hot towel massage. If this is the reason you came to bath, leave a comment below in regards to the price. Now let's get back to our journey, the real reason we came to Bath. Make your way over the bridge, turn left, pass the shack and continue on the trail.
at this point in the journey you will definitely need to change into your swimwear and bathing suit there are a lot of deep waters ahead that is definitely not family friendly so it's definitely if you're the adventure type and you're going out and you want oh there we go falling falling here yeah. so this is definitely not one of my family friendly videos this is definitely for just adventurers because it took a lot to get here a lot of slippery rocks a lot of falling but I'm not gonna lie, the end result was worth it. My advice is to carry a tube or a flotation device. I think this would make the experience a lot more enjoyable. Be careful guys cause the fear will settle in, the water is just too deep, it will affect you mentally, even if you're a good swimmer.
if you're looking for something extra to do you can always visit the botanical garden it is a great place to have a nice relaxing 